What's up everyone, Grectify here today, and I'm going to be showing you guys how to go ahead and burn Xbox 360 games to a dual layer disc. Uh, the capabilities of this is to uh, go ahead and play games, not actually from a game, like from GameStop or, uh, uh, I don't know, Best Buy or something like that. And uh, you can get these games off the internet, and you should, usually you're going to need to have the game if you want it to be legal. Now, it's not up to, it's not my fault if you guys go ahead and burn games that you don't actually own yet, but uh, to be honest, most people do, so... You're going to need to have a flashed Xbox for this, and what that is, is it enables your DVD drive to read these this burnt media we're going to be, sh I'm going to be showing you guys how to burn today. And it needs to be LT Plus for the games I'm going to be showing you guys, and to be safe. Alright, so let's go ahead and get started. You're going to need to go ahead and burn, I'm sorry, not burn, you're going to need to go ahead and get these game, a game. Go ahead and get any game you guys want. Um, try to get games that are newer, because, you know. It's sometimes limited to what you guys play, and uh, you might have a shorter time, you might get banned. There's always a risk of getting banned, guys, I'm sorry. But, uh, okay, so once you download your game, you should get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 parts. Now, what these parts you're going to do is you need WinRAR. What this does is it goes ahead and uh, extracts the files to a .iso file. So you're going to go ahead and right-click the last file. Go ahead and extract to MVL Fifi. Now this might, this is just my game. Extract to whatever game you have. Um, once you do that, it should pop up with a screen. It says uh, zero percent on the top and zero percent on the bottom, and you're just gonna wait a few minutes for it to extract. I already extracted it, so I'm good. So now you're gonna go ahead and go to the game we're extracted to. It should say a, fi a folder named MVL dash. Fifi or whatever your file name is called. So go ahead and go to here and you're going to go ahead and open it. And there should be a .iso file in there. It may not have a .dvd file in there because sometimes they they don't come with .dvd files or sometimes they do. It's all up to what kind of game it is and whatnot. So um all right, you're going to go ahead and go to your well you don't really need anything as long as this is here you're good now so go ahead and exit out of that you don't need any of that stuff now so you're going to go ahead and go to xbox 360 gui now what this does is it actually checks your game crc and uh, other things like the stealth on the video game the stealth um and like uh not just the so sorry i'm getting a little confused because i already recorded this once it just didn't record um so uh, stealth, the DMI, and the split bid in the AP25 sectors of the game. And this will autocorrect and fix it. So let's go ahead and open this. For list of users, please, please, please use run as admin. You don't need Windows 7, you don't need to, but if you want to, you can. Alright. So, go ahead and look at my options here. See these, like, ding, these little, like, tabs right here? Alright, so go ahead and go to options. Make sure your settings are like mine. Make sure they're like mine. Go to manually patch or extract files, make sure they're like this. Go to auto fix, and make sure you go ahead and instead of level 2, make this level 3. So it patches stealth and patches verification. Go to rebuilding, make sure it's like that. And then miscellaneous, you don't need to really change anything in there. So go ahead and get your file from here. You're going to go ahead and search for the .iso file. And uh, this is going to be in your 360 game folder. Then just find the folder that you extract it to. And this should be called, uh, my game was called MVL Fifi, but yours is going to be called something different. So here's the data. So, and this is what the outcome is. I already showed you guys, but this is the outcome of extracting. So double go and double click that. Then you're going to go in here, down here to this like cool little fire thing, and go to launch. It should pop up on the left screen, and it should go all the way down there. And uh, you should check your CRC. That's done, and my stealth passed, my video, uh, V0V1, PFI, DMI, SS, and XCX passage. The CRC matches. Um, go up here if you want, and uh, as you can see, AP25 replay sector is currently verified. You need to run this, or your game may not work. So it may, it may not. So once that's done, it's going to go in here, check game CRC. This is just an extra precaution. Go ahead and let it do that. 
Um, I already did it, so I already know it's valid. So I'm going to go ahead and exit out of this. All right, so now you're done with ABGX360. Now you're moving on to Image Burn. What this does is it actually burns the game to the dual layer disc you're going to need. You need dual layer discs for this to actually go on your Xbox and the flashed Xbox, like I've said previously. So go ahead and open this. Should open with like Image Burn loading, please wait. And it's going to open that up. Alright, so you're going to need to go ahead and instead do not touch any of these buttons yet. Go ahead and go to Tools, go to Settings, and now you, what you're going to see here is you're going to see all these little tabs. Don't touch them, <laughs> please. You might mess something up. Go to Right, and you're going to go ahead and go to, you have to find Options, Layer Break for DL Media. And it's going to be on Calculate Optimal with nothing here. And you need to go ahead and tick, instead of Calculate Media Optimal, click tick user specified now you're going to input this this is very very important your game may not work if you don't have this you're going to need to put in 1913760 again i'm going to put this in description but it's 1913760 all right once that's done go ahead and press okay and now you're going to go ahead and write image file to disk now you're going to go ahead and open your disk drive, whatever you have. Go ahead and put your dual layer media in. Make sure it's blank. And uh, it's going to pop up. And you, uh, put that in first. Now you're going to go to please select a file. So now this is where your .dvd comes in handy. Go ahead and go to Xbox 360 games, wherever your folder, your game is located. Go into the fi folder. Go into the folder. And now you should see these two files, a .dvd and a ISO. .so. Go ahead and pick the .dvd. Um, you can go ahead and pick the ISO, but it's going to auto-correct it for the DVD. So make sure just to press the DVD. Alright, so there we go. Now, you are ready to burn. Alright guys, um, I'm not going to burn it because I already have this game burned. Uh, it's just going to pop up with this. Make sure, oh, I'm sorry guys, I forgot. Make sure with this settings, make sure it's at 2.4. Any more, it may just mess up your disc or something. And make sure, please, 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 use verbatim dual layer discs. Don't use anything else. Don't use Memorex. Don't use TRC or whatever that crap is. Use just verbatim is the best media. I don't care what anyone else says. It's the best because you're going to get read-write errors. You're going to get burning errors. It's just going to be really complicated, but you need verbatim. Trust me. I've been accompanied with this kind of dual layer before, and it pissed me off. <laughs> okay? So, go ahead and get verbatim. And now, that's what you need to burn with. So, put that in the drive. Now, this button should be uh, popped up like this. And go ahead and click that. But, uh, I don't have any dual layer media, and I've already burned this. So, thank you, and it should burn, and it should take 43 to 45 minutes to burn. Depending on what speed you set. But, I suggest 2.4. And make sure it says one copy. Alright, thank you guys for watching. This has been Grectify. Um... Please, guys, please, if you guys need a tutorial, if you guys need a mod tutorial, or you guys want something, go ahead and hit me up for the PM, or uh, put a comment in the video. Uh, this really helps me out, because I, I want to know what you guys want to uh, a tutorial on. Alright, thank you guys for watching. Uh, please, 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 like, thumbs up, this like slash thumbs up this video, and uh, subscribe and comment. Subscribe, please, guys. Please subscribe. I need these subscribers to keep these videos flowing and keep it coming out. So thank you guys for watching. This has been Grectify. Hope you enjoy your new games. Thanks for watching. Bye.